How many of you are suffering from allergies right now, right? The allergens are out in full force already. It's making a lot of people really miserable. Yeah, even pets, kids as well. 41 Action News anchor Cynthia Newsom spoke to doctors to hopefully get you some relief. Deep breaths for me. Melissa Johnson has asthma and allergies. She knows what it's like to suffer when the spring allergy season hits. Oh, shortness of breath and wheezing, watery eyes, itchy eyes, things of that nature. Tree pollen is making life miserable for people with allergies, and this is one of the worst seasons because all the trees are pollinating after a long winter. Children's Mercy Hospital collects the pollen count every day. Uh, allergy specialist Dr. Jay Portnoy said the pollen count is astronomically high. The mere presence of having that many particles in the air is enough to trigger an irritation effect in your eyes and cause eye symptoms. Itchy, watery eyes, you feel like you have to rub them, you're squinting, it's really unpleasant. Allegra, Zyrtec, and generic brands of each are the common go-to medicines during allergy season, but some people complain that these medications are not working for them this season. They wonder if their body has built up an immunity. Most of the time when, um, when people feel like it's not working anymore, it's because those um, those allergic cells are just getting overloaded with the amount of pollens and that kind of stuff that's out there. Melissa got tested for allergies, took allergy shots, and now she's only taking over-the-counter medicine when she needs it. She notices other people suffering and remembers when she was in the same boat. I'm not missing that. I'm definitely not. <laughs> Now she's basically symptom free and smiling. Cynthia Newsom, 41 Action News. Children's Mercy Hospital measures the pollen count every single day and they put that information online. We do have a link on our website at KSHB.com.